Hey you guys, long time no see. So I am here in Yakima right now, I'm in my car. Um, I'm about to get my, try to get my second shot for my COVID test um, because I got a special announcement for you guys. I am heading to Mexico in two weeks. So I wanna try to be fully vaccinated by the time I go. And uh, yeah, oh, also today, this time for sure, I am definitely taking you guys with me at our first vlog for our home distributions. I've been doing them before, I've just never vlogged them. So this time you guys are gonna actually go with me. We're gonna be in Wapato today. And then uh, from there, I'm hanging out with the friend. And then from there, I'll probably just go home and be. That's pretty much it. So yeah, uh, I'm gonna try to get in line before the line starts building up too long. And I will see you guys in a bit. All right, so I'm still in line. I thought it's a quarter past nine. I thought they'd already be going. And um, I'm still waiting so yeah I'll check in with you once I actually get in so finally we are getting here it's almost a quarter to ten two hours later okay finally after almost two hours of waiting in line I got my vaccine I'm just waiting here um, they have us wait after you get your vaccines for 15 minutes to see if you have any kind of reactions. Um, I got about seven minutes left. So from here, I'm late for the distribution, but you know what? I don't give a fuck. So as soon as I get out of here, I'm gonna go head over to Wapato and see what I can do. Uh, I'm really hoping I don't get sick. I don't think I will just because I haven't, I never get sick. And like, even with the flu shots, when they, when people get sick off that, I've never had that happen. So yeah. I hardly ever get sick. But yeah, I will check in with you later. Okay, we are here at the Wapato Community Center. So, looks like they're about to set up for lunch right now. This is officially the very first at-home vlog for our, our distributions, that is. So, I can't wait to show you guys how we get down. Looks like we got a line starting up right now. How are you, Carmen? I'm good, how are you? Good. I saw your stuff posted up on uh, online, so it was really good work. Oh, thank so you. for those who haven't yet, follow her on Instagram. She's doing really good stuff. And my good friend, Robin, you have not followed her yet. Follow her on Instagram and on TikTok. She's amazing. It's for my vlog. That's awesome. That's a badass sweater though. Was that, uh, was that skin style? I don't think so. I don't know. Okay, so it is currently Tuesday afternoon. I am here just working on a couple orders right now. On my bed, I'm making uh, some rosaries. Um, so it doesn't look like much, but one thing I see with TikTok viewers, and I applaud them for it, is the fact that they show their like the process of them making whatever they're making. I just don't have time for that. So uh, I just post whenever I get stuff done and just show the final product. If you haven't already, be sure to check out my Instagram and my TikTok. I will leave the account names right here in the, the screen. And yeah, I'm just gonna work on these until later tonight. Uh, we have our what bus class again. So um, I'm gonna go buy some stuff cause we're, I think we're gonna have a potluck there. So I'll buy like a couple pizzas or something and then uh, take you along with me on that. So I... Stay, yeah. All right, so this is what I have done. Stay, when I got done, I had like one this song or one this song because they were Extra yarn for people to use. Oh, just waiting for everybody to get here. But it takes time. It takes like an hour just to Yeah. So if you don't really understand, then it's like you don't Public food, but we people were very much stuck. Okay, so it is currently Wednesday evening. 
I just got back from having dinner right now. I had to do some shopping. Right now, I am frying up some meat. I'm gonna make some chile verde right now. So I will take you with me as I do that. All right, so here's some of the meat right here. I got more frying up. So I'm gonna do it the shortcut way. Normally, when I make my chile verde, I like to boil tomatillos, get all the ingredients cooked and blended, but Ain't nobody got time for that. I got so much I gotta get done, so I'm gonna show you guys this. This is your best friend. I love this brand. This one and El Pato are probably some of the best brands for Mexican salsas, so uh, keep that in mind. So what I'm, I'm literally gonna do is just I'm not gonna fully cook the meat. I'm just gonna fry it so it gets nice and golden, a little bit seared, and then pour this over, over the meat. Let it marinate overnight, and I'm gonna stick it in the crock pot first thing in the morning, put it on low heat, and it'll be ready to go for tomorrow's dinner. I added some onion. And right there, I added a little chile. Nothing too much, because I want to make sure that it's tolerable for everybody. It's just enough for flavor. I'm going to add a little pinch of cumin. All right, so we're just going to let this marinate overnight. And we'll get this in the crock pot tomorrow. All right, it is currently 6.30 in the morning. I had a hard time trying to wake up. I normally like try to, I'm trying to wake up at 5. But that's not happening anytime soon. But anyways. The meat's been marinating. So now all we gotta do is just stick it in the crock pot. And uh, got some running around to do. I get out early today as well from work. So that's a plus. All right, so it has been what? About six, seven hours is what the meat looks like so far. Just trying to shred it up as little as possible. But yeah, this has been slow cooking for hours. Can't wait to have see what, how people react to it, see how they like it. But yeah. So right now I'm just gonna put aside a little bit for my, my personal trainer, Kyle. I got some beadwork orders, try to make some stuff to sell. Um, I got asked to do some flea markets soon. I got told that there was gonna be some coming up. So I'm gonna try to make up as much stuff as I can to sell for those. And this, hopefully I can try to make a few extra bucks before I leave next week. So yeah, I will take you with me as soon as we have to the potluck. Okay, I'm back home. I forgot, totally forgot to watch, uh, pe film people's reactions eating the chile verde, but none of it's left. So that should tell you how much they liked it. But yeah, this is the end of this vlog. I'll probably just save my filming as I make my way to the airport so I'm really excited for next week. I've been looking forward to this for a long time. And it's finally here. Finally here. We're just coming, counting down the days now. But yeah, I'm going to call it a day. So before I go, just be sure to like, comment, and uh, subscribe to my channel. Bye, Felicia.